some things are hard to get unless you experience them, unless you go through them. So uh, having played in um, a conference tournament game, uh, that, that an, an added level of intensity, uh, and a game that means that much more, you know, I think the more guys you have that have gone through that, uh, it's going to help you in future years. Well, we're, we're real excited um, for this year. Um, as a coaching staff, uh, we've really enjoyed working with this group. Um, they're very coachable, uh, fun to be around. They're very positive with each other uh, and, and how they interact. We feel like we've got some good leadership coming back. Uh, we've got a lot of young pieces, a lot of new guys to blend into the mix. It's probably as young a team as we've had the last few years. Uh, so I don't know how much time it's going to take us to blend it together. Um, but we like what we have to work with, uh, and it's been a real fun offseason. We feel like we've made a lot of progress. You know, we brought in some more size this year, definitely, and then a couple big guys. Um, Darius from California, I mean, he's definitely going to give us the size that we haven't really had in the past. And also, I mean, another one would be like Alex Rivera, who is here from Lowell, but he's definitely coming in and um, impressed me right away and can definitely knows how to play and um, more impressed me that he doesn't back down to anyone you know and coming in as a freshman and he didn't uh, take a back seat by any means to anyone he was ready to go and you can tell that he's not scared of the spotlight. You know two of our keys are going to be um, how much leadership we get from our upperclassmen and uh, we're real fortunate to have Ryan and Josh were named captains and have been here, you know, four or five years. Uh, they know what we're trying to do. They know our system. Um, so we're looking forward to them providing good leadership for us. But not just Josh and Ryan. You know, we've got other upperclassmen um, that can provide leadership. You know, Connor has certainly quietly earned the respect of his two teammates and always seemed to say that the right things at the right time. Um, so he, he can play a role. Uh, Christian uh, and Sean have only been here a year, but they're mature, experienced upperclassmen who have led by example. Um, guys notice their work ethic, their mental approach to the game. Uh, all those guys are going to be pivotal. It's definitely a challenge trying to find a balance for the two of us. I mean, uh, we definitely have to get on them and try to demonstrate and lead by example and you know push them to go beyond their limits that they think they can get because you know high school basketball and college is a lot different and we've tried to uh, you know explain that to them and try to get on them in practice and keep pushing them but at the same time this is uh, a critical time you know there's going to be ups and downs for freshmen and we're trying to you know make sure that they stay uh, even keel and level headed throughout the whole thing and trying to just help them through the ups and downs of it and keep their spirits up while also pushing them at the same time. Our goal is, is always to make the conference tournament, but I think you know even more than that, we'd like to get to the point where we can host you know, a home conference game, uh, and I think we're getting close to that point, uh, which is a good, good sign for the 